Businesses across Siouxland continue to get back to work, getting on their feet as the doors of local businesses continue to open. But what about the doors of future businesses? What is the real estate market in Sioux City post COVID-19? KCA United reporter Jessica Watson takes a look. She investigates in tonight's top story at 10. I'm, I'm right now uh, for the near future. I'm just hoping that we hold on to what we've got. Dick Salem is the owner of Remax Salem Real Estate. He says the pandemic forced him to reduce rents for some of his commercial tenants. But now things are getting back to normal. I'm counting on that we will as long as we keep opening up. But as long, you know, but even though places are open, you go by the parking lot and they're still not you know, like they were before COVID. Realtors say right now there are about 270 commercial properties available in Siouxland, from Storm Lake to Ottawa. The commercial market did see a little bit of a slowdown, but still strong interest in those categories I mentioned before, like industry and office space. There are a lot of businesses, uh, particularly restaurants and bars and so on, that have been pretty strongly impacted. And um, we're, we're still kind of hoping uh, to see uh, a bounce back from that. There's a number of programs in place. And, um, uh, but obviously, we understand there's a, you know, unemployment has gone up. Sioux City Economic Director Marty Doherty says while many local businesses are getting back on their feet, outside companies are continuing to show interest in Siouxland. We've got an Aldi store that just started construction, and we see construction continuing. So um, while we know that there's a lot of impacts uh, uh, on small business, we also are seeing um, some strong signs of new development occurring too. We are getting back to being face to face with the client and showing properties and, and, and getting them into space that they want to see. And that is my favorite part about commercial real estate is really helping the local businesses find the best fit for them and be successful in Siouxland. In Sioux City, Jessica Watson, KCAU 9 News.